Hi, and welcome to Tea Tuesday. Yep, Tea Tuesday. It's hosted by Life with Patty and Kathy's favorite things. I just sat down. It's pouring. It's thundering. We're having a wicked storm. And I forgot my tea. I'm not going to get back up. Just got back from McDonald's and I got myself two sweet teas. Oh yeah, I want to make sure I had enough. Maggie's having a fit because it's thundering and she sees the turkeys out walking around enjoying themselves. But this is an open collab. You can have a beverage of your choice. You can do whatever you would like to do. You can color, you can talk, you can craft. You can just sit quietly and work on a on something, whatever you would like. And it's called Tea Tuesday, a beverage of your choice. And um, you can opt in and opt out whenever you would like. It's on Tuesday, post any time of day that you would like. Um, that's all I could think of. There's so much you could do for Tea Tuesday. It's whatever you'd like to share. So let's get started. And this is, of course, the book I'm reading. It's going to be good, y'all. And this is by Brenda Grant. Gant, excuse me, Gant. And can you believe we've, we've done this much of the book so far? And let's see what we have this week. Oh, we got a nice one. It's called Uncle Pickens Pear Pie. Pears are just about ready here in Maine. And let me show you a picture. And if you want to take a still, you can of the recipe. It's right here. And don't doesn't that look good? Oh my word. Yum yum sums it all up to me. And I will take some pictures and I'll put it in the description box below. So let's get started because it's thundering and it's lightning. If you look out here, I don't want to be caught in no lights if the lights go out. It says, Uncle Pickens Pear Pie. Uncle Pickens was famous for his pear pie. One time he accidentally used salt instead of sugar since they look the same. We couldn't eat it, but we love laughing about that story. Oh my, I bet it was so funny. I'd have laughed too. I mean, we all make mistakes. You need six to seven firm, fresh pears, peeled, sliced, and boiled in water. Five slices of white bread cut in half inch strips. One stick of salted butter melted. One large egg beaten one tablespoon of white lily all-purpose flour, one and a half cups of sugar, a half a teaspoon of cinnamon, preheat the oven to 350, drain pears when the fork tender, place pears in a 13 by nine casserole dish, place bread strips on top of the pears, Mix melted butter, eggs, flour, sugar, cinnamon together. Pour all over the bread strips, making sure to cover as much as the bread as you can with the mixture. Bake for 30 minutes. It says bake, but it, oh, at 350. You want to make sure you bake this at 350. I am, I am the vine, yeah. Of the branches that he abide in me and I in him, the same bringing forth much fruit, for without me he can do nothing. John 15 5 KJV. Uncle Pickens. Uncle Pickens was George's uncle, his daddy's brother. He served in the army during World War II in the Pacific Ocean, and he always said he spent more time on the ship than the Navy. He was on the ship in Tokyo Bay when the Japanese surrendered George and Uncle Pickens were very close. When George was in high school, he helped Uncle Pickens build his house. After George and I moved to, 
I do not know the name of this town. I'm going to give it a shot. Andalusa, we lived just down the road from him, and he would come eat with us often. Well, let me show you again, and I'm going to take a picture. So look in the description box, and at the end of this video, you'll have all the information on this wonderful Uncle Pickens Pear Pie. Have a great day. God bless. We hope to see you next week. And please go support everybody that's doing Tea Tuesday. We'll see you again on my next video. Bye now.